Hello and welcome to Mighty DLL's tutorial in Fancy Store Online about how to duplicate items and mesetas. In this tutorial I'm going to show you exactly how to do that. This is the Nintendo GameCube version. And uh, to prepare ourselves uh, we have to make sure that we have the I carry the item that we're going to duplicate first of all naturally and we also must make sure that there are there is some space left at the deposit and we go to item here and we can see here um, oh wrong take sorry take item and here we can see for example in this case that I have uh, 170 items so there is plenty of space left because the duplicated items will end up here eventually uh, okay, and we must also make sure that I'm not carrying any money. So I'm dropping all my money now. 900,000 missed has gone. Ooh. Okay. Okay. That should be it. And also you must make sure at the deposit that you have at least one item. That is also required, that you need to have at least one item at the deposit, otherwise this cheek will not work. Okay. Here at the shop, and this woman is the first thing we have to take advantage of because uh, we have to make her to get her to over here to the armor shop. We have to talk to her over and over again to get her closer and closer. This may be a little bit tricky, but with a bit of practice, ah, yeah, you'll get her there. Almost there. Come on. Come on, lady. Get over here. Come on. Don't look away. Ach. This can be a little bit frustrating, but trust me, it's worth it. Let's see if this goes up. Yeah, okay, okay. Talk her. Turn around. Talk to the shopkeeper. And now we can see the message here is um, uh, still on the screen while I'm on this buy sale screen. Press A for buy. And now you press A button a couple of times. You can see the uh, the text, her text uh, talking here in the background. You can see that text there. Press A a couple of times to make this vanish. Gone. Now you press uh, left on the analog stick, and you will hear a walking sound. And when you have heard this walking sound about three times, then you press A button a couple of times. But you have to do this quite quickly, otherwise it won't work for some reason. So let's see if it works now. There it goes. Uh, three times or something. And press A a couple of times and then you get to this screen. Okay, at this screen you press B button. And then you press A button. And now you have this screen. And in this case it could be two scenarios. This is how it is supposed to be. You can see an orange stripe here. Uh, that means it is as it's supposed to be. Sometimes, however, this orange stripe is not here. Then it will look like this. Uh, this sign is green. If that happens, just press the B button once and this will turn into orange again. Okay. Uh, now we go back to the deposit. Talk to the lady. I talk to her. Talk to her. Ah. There we go. Now we go to take a button and then we go to item a button and you press a button once again the yes no item will a uh, yes no option will appear and here you press the combination b b a and b and then you should have this option and these two the deposit and take options available here you press the start button and then this menu will come up the item and make sure here that item and deposit are highlighted. That's, then you press the A button. And now you're supposed to uh, g uh, make sure that you select items. But you, you should also make sure that items here in the background is, uh, is highlighted as well. So in this very case I have to press up once to go to equip to move this cursor up while this still is up. 
and then we press down once items items both are highlighted okay we press the a, a button and we are on the screen and here we have so to say a double screen of all the items and in this case we will copy the red handgun because it is so useful uh, okay we have it highlighted press a button and here you press down so that no and drop are highlighted you cannot have yes because if you have yes and press a the entire game will lock up and we don't want that so we go down to no and drop press a button and now we press start okay and now with the red handgun still uh, highlighted we press a button again and here on the yes no screen we just press a uh, I mean yes a button okay and now we press B button and now the item so to say is copied uh, it is available in the deposit in the storage uh, uh, from this point you can do this trick again to copy even more items if you want you just press start button again and uh, item deposit and then press up again and have items items again and um, uh, we can do it one more time just for the fun of it we can uh, take a scape doll this time and uh, in this case scape dolls are just a tiny bit different because you so to say have to make sure that no and drop are um, highlighted again you perhaps you need to fill around with the up down a little bit but it shall always be no and drop okay start button again and press a again and press select yes a button and then you click B to remove to close all screens so one scrape doll and one red handgun let's check the deposit voila here is the red handgun we didn't have it as you can see here we have 172 items now out of sudden instead of 170 as before and we also have one scape doll here okay I have plenty of scape dolls so it may be a little bit difficult to see but there is one more scape doll now for certain okay that's all about uh, how to uh, uh, copy items and now we are going to copy money uh, okay in order to do this trick you need to have at least one photon drop uh, but the more you have the better if you have 99 this will go much quicker if you don't have 99 only have one then do this trick all over again until you have 99 items uh, when you have copy the item go to deposit and uh, get the photon drop place it into your inventory and repeat over and over again till you have 99 okay as you can see on the screen here I don't have any mesetas at all because I dropped it and that's how it's supposed to be and we do the same thing again get that woman over here to the shop Come see, come see. I'm not gonna rob you, I'm just gonna use you. Press this away. One, two, three. And B, A. Ah, oh, here. This time it didn't turn orange. Okay, we just press the B button. And voila, it's back, as it's supposed to be. And we basically perform the same trick again. Ah. Come on, talk to her, talk to her. Take, item, press A, and combination, B, B, A, B. Deposit and take, and uh, uh, item and deposit are highlighted, press A, and item, and item, highlighted, A button. And then we go to the photon drops and uh, we, uh, just uh, press drop instantly that's perfectly fine and then we go to no of course otherwise if you take yes the game will lock up no press start button and here you press a 
and now you go down uh, press to the num uh, maximum amount of items you have in this case 99 and press A and A again yes A. pick up the 99 fortune drops here and look there there are 99 more photon drops great we had duplicated 99 photon drops and now let's go to the shop and we sell all them all 99 voila we have 99,000 mesetas and of course you can do this all over and over again make sure of course in the deposit that, that you before you sell the photon drops that there still are 99 in your deposit otherwise you will sell them and won't be able to duplicate them anymore so that's all i hope this tutorial has been useful for you if you need any help drop a comment or drop me a personal me message and i promise to help you out thanks and goodbye